Welcome to MTD's Technical Corner. Now today we're talking about something fairly interesting. This is about e-commerce in machine shops. Selling parts online, this sounds very scary, Oscar. Um, how did it start? You mentioned something off camera about 3D printing leading the way. Yeah, I think the additive manufacturing industry, due to the nature of how the parts are made, was very quick to adopt the idea of automated instant quotations. But what we're seeing is off the back of that, laser cutting shops, CNC shops, even injection molding companies, especially over in the States, although it's now becoming a global trend, they're all starting to realize the value in rapid quoting, whether it's just inside their company using a software tool or actually allowing their customers to quote online. And how have they been so successful this far? Is, is, is the fact that they've got quick quotes and customers being able to buy things off their website instantly, is that, is that played a part in their success? Yeah, I think what's probably played a big part of it is there's a new generation of engineering buyer. And this is a generation that's kind of been brought up using Amazon and self-service tools online. You know, they're quite tech savvy. And their preference really in most cases is to not pick up the phone or email. It's to buy parts online via some sort of self-service platform. And it's why we've seen such massive growth in some of the industry leaders, you know, turning over hundreds of millions of dollars a quarter. And um, it's really what the new generation of engineering buyers looking for is a way to buy online. And for those subcontractors listening to this and thinking, well, I'm not a big manufacturing company in the US. I, I'm, I'm in Coventry, I've got 15 machines. Yeah. And I like to know who my customers are. I like to make parts for them. Um, how, how does moving to e-commerce as a really big step change, mm -hmm. how's that gonna help them? Yeah, so whilst it might seem a little bit daunting, you know, you're not a software company, you're a machine shop, Digifabster has the tools and, and the experience basically to allow you to adopt the same practices as these huge online manufacturing giants, but make it suitable for your audience, your geography, and the sorts of parts and business that you do. Yeah, absolutely, because these people have been making, um, sometimes they make really high volumes, really low volumes, um, but someone's got to come in and call you up for a one-off, mm -hmm. when actually they might want to just get one really, really quickly. Absolutely, normally the quoting process is phone calls, emails, lots of back and forth. So your head of engineering might spend a while producing a quote only for say two thirds of those quotes not to actually follow through to an order. All that time's wasted and really the customers had to wait around and ultimately send the order elsewhere. The customer gets a much better experience if they can self-serve, see a price or even an estimate and then perhaps even order that part online before the order's gone to the competition. Absolutely, can you take me, talk me through the process of how actually the buying process works mm. from, the, from the customer's side? So I understand that the customer will have a website yep. and then you have Digifabstar do some magic. What is the magic? Sure, so yeah, most machine shops uh, have a website. They might have a form on there where a customer can click inquire now or get me, get me a quote. Now those forms, we've all experienced it. They can be quite cumbersome. First name, last name, what do you need? Whereas we replace that with what we call a quoting widget. So whereby before a customer might just fill in loads of details and then follow up with an email, they can now upload their parts straight into the platform, choose from the technologies you offer in your shop, choose a material, tolerance, priority level, and then perhaps various post-processing options, followed by seeing their estimate or perhaps even ordering the parts there and then. You know, there's more than 40 different payment methods they can choose from. They can produce invoices and upload purchase orders within the platform. So most of the admin associated with getting a quote and placing an order is taken care of by the customer in their own time without having to burden you. And effectively, you can keep your machines busy without even putting in any work. So not only does it save the quote, someone who's doing the quoting, the sales, um, all of those business processes that aren't actually manufacturing the component itself. Mm -hmm. I guess the subcontractors here, would, who was, they're thinking, well, if someone comes on the, the weekend, they order 10 parts, I wake up Monday morning, I've got 10 parts to make. Surely it can't be that easy for subcontract machinists. I think I mentioned before the video, we had a customer come on board last month. They've been using the system for one month. They've had enough orders in that first month just via their website to actually pay for the software package itself. So the ROI is very clear. The customers have spoken. You know, they're looking for this. They're looking for suppliers who offer instant quotes online. Um, and whilst not everything will be automated, you might have some larger volume quotes or high value parts that should go through a manual process. This will trigger that and allow that to happen but the majority of work can be automated. And we're seeing more and more that those suppliers with online tools 
are seeing very quick growth compared to the competition. Yeah, you you can imagine if a subcontractor's got a website, but it says got like a get in touch button or an mm. email us form. Um, there might be people who are put off by that and they might buy a single one now. And mm -hmm. I guess someone might say, well, they're only gonna be buying one off. So that's not useful to me, I want a thousand off. Yeah. But if someone gets a good part made today, mm -hmm. maybe that uh, that turns into a good customer in, in a year from now. Absolutely, and the benefit of having it all in a platform as well is you've got tracking and traceability of all those people that order ones and twos, and then you can continue to drip feed and nurture those customers um, to the point where they become big key accounts for you. It's almost like an online CRM system for all those little mm. customers that want to that are local to you, look at your website, but but you never quite click the button. Yeah. So today's one part order is tomorrow's thousand part order, and that's where you start to see real growth. So for those subcontractors who are still maybe a little bit daunted by the idea of uh, instant quoting and an e-commerce system to try and sell their components, how can they get started? Sure, so we put our money where our mouth is. We do offer a free trial and you can jump straight into that just by heading to digifabster.com forward slash get started. And there's a trial on there and in the little box in the corner you can speak to myself or my team and ask any questions you need. Mm -hmm.